You see this screen? This screen looks like a piece of shit. Subway looks like a piece of shit now because The Miz did a promo a few days ago about Subway. What the fuck? The Miz did an advertising promo? What the fuck, man? What the hell happened to this guy's career? He went from a main uh, Carter, high Carter, all the way down to a mid Carter, lower mid Carter, and just like a few pay per views. What the hell? First he lost his title, then he lost the rematch, and then he lost against his new feud with Alex Riley. Now nobody gives a shit about the guy. What kind of stupid shit is this? And if you're gonna... Now the Miz is actually doing a decent job wrestling and doing promos and going outside of the shows, and he's still not doing shit otherwise in the rank. This guy lost his last match in the pay-per-view. It was a... Six man tag team match. This is a piece of shit, man. Now he's trying to say that he's better at doing subway promos than that fat ass who's advertising that shitty food. You don't lose weight from eating subway, guys. Subway is very starchy, and a lot of food it doesn't have much good stuff for the nutrients of your body. Although there's some beneficial things. Regardless, and, and he ate that sandwich as if it was a pussy. Did you notice he ate it like it was a vagina? That was disgusting. I bet he puked afterwards. Because he was eating it like a pig. Like It looked like that screamed to puke. I mean, this is ridiculous. First, he jobs to Rey Mysterio, John Morrison, and uh, whoever the third face happened to be in a pay-per-view. I keep forgetting this shit. Now, this is getting ridiculous. I mean, you guys have so much potential to put this guy in some decent mid-card matches. Bring back his food with Alex freaking Riley. That's the smart thing to do. If not, um, give him a tag team. Give him a freaking tag team. You know what I noticed? You guys had The Miz and Alex Riley, but you never gave them decent tag team matches that were for a title. So what's the freaking point of him? He was just there... To as the Mrs. Bitch. I bet when Alex Riley was complaining about how he had to carry the Mrs. Bags, he was talking about his nutsacks. This was for. If, if you're gonna have a guy in a high carter and make him descend, at least have him do something. Don't have him do these stupid subway promos. Are you guys freaking kidding me? I mean, you saw that powerbomb the Mrs. Terry Mysterio and that cutter? He's doing a better. having a better moveset. Back when he was a heel. He wasn't very creative with his cheating. He was using cliched cheating techniques. And, his, and he, he just finished matches with his finisher, which wasn't very impressive. And still isn't impressive. He needs a better finisher. But overall, now he's showing potential. And as soon as he's showing that he can do something, you put him on the mid card again. It's like he was on the mid card for a while and totally jobbing up. And now he's on the high card, and well, then he was on the high card. Now you put him on the mid card again. You guys are stupid ass motherfuckers. You can't just make someone go from mid to high to mid in that swift of a movement. You gotta have some balance, you son of a bitch. Seriously, there's a talent deficit, and you're doing stupid shit like this. I mean, that was a wasted promo. You could have did a match with that. That was a lot of talking right there. Maybe like a really short five minute match. I mean, um, I could have probably enjoyed uh, Miz versus Evan Bourne matchup. You could have done that. But no. You had to make it the most pointless thing ever. Bring that motherfucker from Subway. I hope you guys are really losing money because of this. Because you're probably doing this because you have a little money and you need sponsorship from Subway. But it's going to be worse if you do things like that. So WWE, change your rules. Use Miz better. Make him act awesome like he does outside of WWE. Give him that sense of humor. Pack that inside here. And... Give him some good ass matches. Make him go for a tag team again. He's really great with tag teams. Like, what would be a great tag team? Give him Evan 
uh, give him Drew McIntyre. Drew McIntyre needs some support. Alright, I'm done.